Hello, welcome back to Frogboy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew, and today we're doing another Forspoken video. So if you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, let's get started with this. So, um, I have already purchased the uh, PlayStation 5 version of Forspoken for the channel. And um, actually, I did a... I did a poll today asking, you know, the community and, you know, over on Twitter if I should cover this on the PC as well. And uh, there is enough interest in that for me to go ahead and uh, to pick up both versions of that. So we're going to do that. I am going to buy the, uh, the Forspoken on the Xbox uh, store, though, uh, for the PC. We're going to we're going to buy that. So this is apparently the first game to to use the uh, the direct storage application in DirectX 12. So that there is going to be pretty interesting. I want to also see if uh, other technologies like DLSS or uh, other technologies are going to be used to uh, to enhance the visuals and you know provide provide better performance. We're going to look closely um, at things like textures. Uh, settings and other things in those videos. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do like this whole like uh, trying to make PlayStation look bad type video with that. That is not the intention. The intention is to to show off this game and give you the option to to pick the best the best version possible for for you. Um, I I really am liking this game. So it's one of those things where I want to be able to cover it from from that from that standpoint as opposed to boom. I want to, yeah. <laughs> okay, sorry. I, I'm getting caught up in that. I want to just run around and not worry about the, and not worry about that. Um, for the most part, like I said, I found a way to to make it look pretty decent on on my 4K TV. So for the most part, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy with the, you know, I'm 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 pretty satisfied for the most part with how this looks on the PC. So that there's not really gonna really gonna bug me too much. I I could potentially be able to play this game. For the most part, um, without without really any without really any problems with that, playing this at sixty frames a second. But I am curious to see just how far past the PlayStation we can get with the uh, with the with the with the PC version. So that's going to be kind of interesting to see how far this this uh this actually does continue to go um let's see okay. yep. Come on. i thought there was like one that i can uh that has like the the multiple Yeah, scatter shot. Let's see. Nope, not working. Ooh, yeah. i so I've been I've been I've been pretty excited about this game. Like I've been I've been playing it like every day when I get home from work and and making a video on it, uh, trying to uh, check this out because, man, I just I think there's gonna be something pretty cool that happens with this game guys and uh the more the more i uh the more i play around with it the more i the more i get used to the to the way the combat feels and i'm like oh man that is pretty freaking sweet I don't like the look of this. oh no can't see a fucking thing just breathe it'll be over soon enough no. okay so i i do like i do kind of like the ranged mechanics but I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, I, I feel like I like the... I, I feel like I'm more... Uh, I feel like I'm liking the uh, the melee a lot better. But I do... I love the freaking speed of traversal in this game. Gosh, man. That is something that I really, really, really like. Like, that to me is... 
is even is even cooler than than like some of the stuff. Oh, look at this freaking water. Let's see. Uh, that hoverboard thing that we're going to be getting in this game. I can't wait to... Um, you know what? Yeah, see, I like the melee better. I like to be, like, up close and personal. Like, this is so freaking cool. Like, I like this. Boom! I really do like the combat and everything in this game. Boom! See, like, that's just, that's cool to me. That is cool to me, man. I, I don't know. Like, the, the story content, man. If this game has a good story... Like that's gonna be freaking awesome like you get these these right here like these little um ooh let's see so well, that one's gonna wanna be right there Let's see. So we could take this one back over and put that back up. Boom! Yeah, unlock it. So yeah, that I mean that's even kind of cool. Done. Being able to unlock these boxes and find some really cool stuff like an old coin. That's it, an old coin. I like this. I like this parkour, man. And this here, right here, like, I mean, yeah, this is like a pretty open space right here. But, I mean, you look at, like, these textures and stuff, and th that doesn't look bad at all. I mean, we've seen we've seen a lot worse. Um, I will give this game 100% props for its implementation with the DualSense. I will give, I will give that, like, 100%. Uh, props for the way the dual sense feels because when you're like jumping and you bounce around and move and stuff like you can feel that and that is cool like i i will give this game props for for proper implementation implementation of dual sense support that is something that's kind of i'm pretty happy about see like look at this right here like this this image this doesn't look bad um you won't be able to see it the way i'm seeing it because i've got this in vivid uh, putting this in vivid really just brings out the 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 color in this game, and it looks so nice. Wait, what the heck are we doing, Frey? Get over here, Frey. Come on, did you do it? There we go. Yep. Uh, get on up there. See, I want to see up here. I don't think it's gonna let me go too high though. Um, we're gonna find a bag of chocolate. You cannot travel beyond this point. See, but when you're up here and you look out, okay, now you could see that that over there is probably, it's probably some sort of, like, it looks kind of like an ocean or whatever, but then you got, like, the mountains. Uh, let's, let's go down that way and get on that bridge. I haven't, I don't think I've checked out that bridge over there. So let's get over there and take a look at that. I changed out my my cloak and everything. Got this black one on. This one's pretty cool. Like I just I love speeding around through this open world. Like it is fun. Man, and if this has got a good story. Now I am wanting to see, you know, exactly how the PC version is gonna act on this too. Um and see how Let's see how that that's gonna feel on the oh i'm already stocked up for those so let's get over here bing oh no i like these 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 right here so you can freaking build like some health potions and stuff because you'll want those okay so i think this is the bridge because uh, i haven't went over here and looked at this yet either 
Ooh, a monument of wisdom. What the hell is this? Yeah, so I mean, we're just kind of playing. I'm just talking about it, giving my thoughts on on like first spoken and what 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 like has got me interested in it. A bridge too far. Defeat the boss within the time limit. All right, let's let's see what we can do. Defeat the boss. Three, two, one, going. Put your best foot forward. Wish I could put it up your ass. Huh. Uh. See, I don't, I don't. Oh yeah. Nope, not working. Whoa! All right, we're gonna go over here to. Uh. Whoa! Shoosh! I've beat one of these before, so they're not they're not like too hard. Freak. Yeah. Boom. Another enemy has appeared. Like, how many freaking enemies does it need to appear to freaking help this boss? Boom. All right, a new archive. About as good as could be expected. So, Are you trying yeah, to nice. Me off? First time bonus. Ooh, some mana. Nice. So you can, like, keep taking her on and... <clears throat> That's pretty cool. Like, you can keep taking her on and, and like, gaining more points and stuff. <clears throat> so that is pretty cool. <sighs> so, <clears throat> like, I am pretty, pretty, pretty excited about this game, to tell you the truth, guys. Like, I'm, I'm not seeing, like, really anything that's, I, I'm not, like, there was a lot of stuff that, like, they were just showing us, like, stuff out of place, you know, just, like, going up to, like, big open areas that looked empty and, like, some of the, some of the stuff they were showing off and, like, that was kind of throwing me off. It was like, what a... What is this, man? Because it, it looked weird. But to see it on your own screen, for me to see this on my own screen and, and kind of judge, you know, the way things, the surrounding areas and everything look in comparison to, like, the stuff they were showing, like, that, like, trust me, that stuff was giving me pause on this game. But now that I'm, like, starting to see it and, uh, it, it's, uh, it definitely changes that, uh, it, it changes the way I was feeling about it, like, a lot. I like this combat. I like the... Like, this just... She looks cool when she moves, man. Like, this this looks cool. Like, the, the combat and the... Like, it, it looks so nice. I'm glad that I decided to give this one a chance, man. I I mean I turned it on when I first got when I when I first got the demo and I looked at it and I was like, oh boy, I don't know about that. But then uh ha, the more I play this, the more I'm like the more I am in like in love with it. Seriously. Oh wait, I think I've already I think I've already checked that out. So let's go over Oh, did I just not cross that bridge last time I I came this way or something? That sounds weird. Why would I do that? Why would anybody do that? Whew. Let's get up here. Yeah, so, yeah, I didn't take this, so obviously I didn't come up here. Oh, I, I remember. I did come up here, but then I jumped onto those over there. I was going for those. Wait, why would why would that be there? What's that one going to take me to? Oh, a cross. Oh, but I can't go over there. 
No! That would have been so freaking sweet to get over there. Yeah, see, like, this right here? Okay, so, like, when you look at this, like, this rock formation and this, the, the way this looks right here, guys, like, those trees and everything, that doesn't look bad at all. That actually looks fairly nice. And if I see, like, when I'm playing this game and there's, like, more stuff like this, like, this right here gets me excited, makes me happy. I'm like, yeah, dude, that looks good. I'm okay with that. But then there are the things. Let me, let's go over here and I'll show you. There are the things that do give me pause, and that is this right here like this little village or whatever from from like fast inspection like running up to it like this looks like it's ripped straight out of uh looks like it would be ripped straight out of like uh Nair automata but then you get down here and you actually like look at the groundwork and you look at the the stuff in here you come over here and you get closer over here to the to the thing and you can see like the vines that are that are hanging down you can see the wood piles and the, and the garbage piles and stuff with the with a nicer fine texture in there and you and you just start looking at it and you're like oh you know what look at this look at the walls like they they actually have texture and they're they're properly you know they 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 have proper like shading and stuff on them they they look pretty nice i mean it doesn't look perfect by any means but it definitely looks better than than what i than what i expected you know you oh dude you come in here and you find another chest sorry this is just an open house but yeah that's what i'm saying like from far away like these things like these towns they don't look that great but then when you get in here and you actually get close to a wall and stuff and you're like oh okay you know what there is some there is some freaking there is some uh, there there obviously is some texture and some detail and everything and i mean like look at the draw distance though like yeah like the draw distance is one thing you know like you when you're when you're going over there you see that see like how close that that them them real plants dry in so like from far away it kind of looks a little bit weird and you know it's just little things like that that i was noticing as i was playing or as i was watching like their their reveals and stuff but then when i start actually playing this and i'm and i'm getting in here and i'm and i'm looking at the game with my with my own eyes on my own on my own screens and stuff i like what i'm seeing for the most part I can I can 100% support this. Like I'm I'm okay with this. Um, I am playing in the performance mode right now too, and uh, I I did watch that Digital Foundry video today, um, the, the the one that was the one that they put out on this or whatever, and they, um, and it's not 720p guys. He's saying that it was 900p, but you could have fooled me, man. Like you seriously could have fooled me. Like that's that's what it looked like when I first turned it on in performance. It looked like 720p. Um, with some of the with some of the vegetation and stuff around here and you know and I thought somebody said that they said it was like 720p or something because that's I hadn't watched that video I just barely watched it uh, but yeah man like look at these like look at these animals let's see if I can get close without having to fight them Don't worry. This will be quick. they actually look pretty cool that's the Good thing job. like Take that, you freaking monsters! Here you go, doggies. Those are Dunzo. Dunzo. See, I. You know, like dirt texture in the game is looking pretty decent. Like it looks really nice. I mean, like, like uh, I don't know, man. Like her her skin, the animations, like the way, like, yeah, this like looks pretty dang good, guys. Like, look at her knuckles in her hand. Like, look at look at her knuckles. Like that is pretty freaking detailed, man. Like that is pretty detailed. Her fingers, like that looks extremely detailed, man. <laughs> like that this looks pretty dang good man like i'm starting to really like uh the more time i spend with this game the more i really start to like the luminous engine like let's see the tree the tree work like look at this okay i don't know if you can see it that well but look at the detail in this tree like that is 
incredible. That's incredible. That looks that looks really good. But what look from back here though. It just it just looks like a like a regular tree, but the the, the closer you get into the closer you get to to a to looking at things on here, like it holds up really really well even on this 4K screen. Like like look at this, man. You can see like the little knots in the tree. You get to see like the branches that are coming out. Like there's the more I the more I inspect and the more I see of this engine and the vegetation and stuff, the more I'm like, whoa, man, that looks really freaking nice. I mean, you look out here, and uh, yeah, I mean, like looking across there at the way, it, it might look a little a little a little empty or barren or whatever, but. I don't know, man. I don't feel like this game is empty and barren, dude. I feel like this thing is 100% well thought out and well planned. I like this combat. I like having fun with this. Like, this is good. The music is pretty decent in this game. I don't really care to fight those guys. I like the movement system in here. This looks so freaking nice, man. Like, I can't wait to see this on the, uh, on the PC as well. I mean, I probably will end up playing through this on the PC version, but... I don't know, man. Like, this is holding up pretty decently on PlayStation 5. That, uh, finding out that this is the first game to run on the direct storage API, that, that's kind of like a, a no-brainer to have both of them. Because then I can compare, like, direct storage to the, to the PlayStation 5 storage. <clears throat> You know what you don't really notice in this game is a whole lot of popping. I mean, you you do notice it, but like it's like it's more like transition. It's more like transition as opposed to just straight up popping. See like when you're running and stuff, like I'm not noticing any kind of stuff popping in, but I am noticing every once in a while I notice like a transition change. As you run back over this way. Yeah, see? Like, I don't know, man. This isn't... <clears throat> up on the ridge. Up on the ridge, you do kind of see some popping. Don't let them outflank you. Not gonna happen. See, I mean, I, I do like that. I just kind of wish that felt a little bit smoother. Like, a little bit more... Ooh, like, like you would just like when you see those, I wish it was more just like a, instead of having to stop and kind of not necessarily aim for it, but just be able to, to like hit the button like you, like you wouldn't like Sekiro, you know, like it just gets like a thing. I kind of wish it was like that. I don't have enough materials. Oh, I just want the healing drops. I don't want the medicine pouch thing. Okay, there we go. That's all I wanted. That's all I wanted. Now I want to go back outside. Into I changed my mind. I want to rest some more. Like the vegetation in this game for the most part looks pretty decent. You wouldn't be saying that if you knew I'm excited for this. I'm excited for this. Oh my gosh, dude, we're already at like 23 minutes. <laughs> I'm so sorry guys. I did not mean to uh to really take up too much time but yeah there i i like this game guys like i'm i'm so i'm pretty excited about this i like the way this one is looking so all right guys if you like this content don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching